be talking about lung disease today and uh, two primary issues that i want to discuss are at loss of beta adrenergic stimulation and excessive alpha adrenergic stimulation what can they do in lung pathologies so loss of beta adrenergic stimulation as we know in disease like asthma and copd there is uh, bronchospasm and uh, we give drugs like salbutamol salmeterol for uh, beta adrenergic stimulation so that bronchospasm is resolved and we've also discussed like when there is adrenal insufficiency there are less beta adrenergic receptors in the lungs and more alpha adrenergic receptors remain those alpha adrenergic receptors will cause uh, dry cough and excessive alpha adrenergic stimulation uh, later on can lead to fibrosis in the lung and an interstitial lung disease kind of picture both low beta adrenergic stimulation as well as excessive alpha adrenergic stimulation can lead to different kind of lung pathologies Thank you.